Shouldn't these options be there automatically though, I hear you say? Well, Microsoft is moving towards native labeling in Office and cloud services. And for many organizations, that is enough. But the client fills gaps for now for advanced bulk or non-office scenarios. And for organizations with hybrid or complex environments, over time, more features will very, very likely be integrated natively. But the client is still required for certain advanced or legacy scenarios. So let's take a look at how this looks in my own OneDrive here. If I want to do something directly from the Explorer, I can select the document, I can right click on it and show more options. I really hate Windows 11. And I can apply sensitivity label with Microsoft Purview from that toolbar. It opens up the information protection file labeler and it gives me the options of the labels that have been published to my user object. And I can choose here between personal, public, or super confidential, or I can protect with custom permissions. And here I can select the drop down and choose between viewer, reviewer, co author, co author all permissions are only for me. And I can select particular users, groups, or organizations and set an expiry date. I'm not going to do that in this example. I'm just going to put the super confidential label onto this document and click on apply. It works away and it does that in a couple of seconds and I can close the labeler. Now, can I do this in bulk? Let's select a few documents and I will right click again and I will go to show more options, apply sensitivity label with Microsoft Purview. And again, I have this option to label all of those files. Note that it says multiple files selected here. I'll click on public in this occasion and I will click on apply. And in this particular example, you can see the labeling policy comes into play because either one or more of the documents I've selected obviously has another label applied already. So I can just select the previous label no longer applies or was incorrect, or I can put in another explanation with a written justification. I'll just put the previous label was incorrect and I will click on confirmed, tells me it's finished and seven files are processed. I can show the results if I want to here as well. So let's see what that looks like. And it opens it in Excel and it tells me exactly what has happened. And then I can close. 